after football is something that every player eventually has to deal with, be it high school, college, or pro. And life can be difficult for men whose gridiron clock has run out. But today, I caught up with a former high five college and NFL star who has found his post football career. He's traded in one of these for one of these. There you have your jacket on, your pants on, and then once you put the helmet on, it's like in football, you click in, you better be locked and loaded and ready to go because you never know what, type, what the situation might bring. Craig Lumpkin has suited up as a Stevenson High School Jaguar. He still go all the way. A Georgia Bulldog. And on Sundays in the NFL. But nothing compares to being a Clayton County firefighter. Honestly, I get fulfillment knowing that I've I've done I've given myself and given myself up to save somebody else. Lumpkin graduated from firefighting training in November and immediately hit the front lines. I had to cut um, cut a window, cut a cut a hole in in somebody's uh, kitchen, spray water in there, make sure it didn't get all the way in the roof. Lumpkin says there are clear ties to football. The firehouse is just like being on a team. Yeah, you always want to protect and make sure you protect yourself as well as um, protect your crew and your partner. Also like football, just as much work goes on in the classroom as in the field. The morning check off, you would go through all these cabinets. When we met up with Lumpkin, he had just gotten out of a medical training class. Hydraulic generator, air tanks, air tanks. And then there's the fitness aspect, which Lumpkin was obviously built for. And he looks forward to the opportunity of playing one last game as a Bulldog. So how did Lumpkin pick this career? It's a topic we've been asking him about since Buck Lanford did this story back in 2007. Lumpkin has already earned two degrees. What are you going to do when you grow up? <laughs> uh, if not uh, in the NFL, probably property management, real estate, um, just trying to make a living. Trying to make a living. Was <laughs> firefighting at all a part of in that mindset? Honestly, when I was little, I wanted to be a firefighter. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Was there a moment that you had an interaction or you just saw him out just, or just, just riding see, the truck? Just seeing the trucks, hearing the trucks, and like opportunity to get on one of these things and learn out what it is. Now, now I have the opportunity to do It's amazing. Lumpkin says he's tried to stay low key and that his station mates have embraced him in his football past and his goals from here. Well, they just make sense for a firefighter. Keep climbing the ladder. Keep climbing the ladder, which makes total sense. He played in the NFL with the Bucks and the Packers, the Seahawks and the Giants. And Tom, after football, he tried teaching and he tried real estate, which mm -hmm. is what his degree was in. But he said the firefighter helmet, when he puts on that helmet, it reminds him of wearing a, a football. Yeah, helmet. I'd say firefighting sounds more exciting than management or real estate, which is what <laughs> he was a, talking about with Buck. And if you look at him, he needs to be a firefighter out there carrying the hoses and the ladders and everything. Yeah. He looked great. What a great guy. Yep. All right, Cody, thanks. And thank you for joining us tonight for Fox 5 News Edge. TMZ coming